We are supervisors of these people. We are supervisors of the technical team. How can you say in this letter that you are just mere politicians, you, you, we don't even know how you came here, you are not even qualified, you are what, 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 what. For us, we are professional, we are technical, we go through processes here. Be in an institution where one, a person who is the accounting officer, who is in charge of billions of, you, of taxpayers' money, can behave like this. Worship this letter is just meant to intimidate and blackmail authority members. And I think as the authority, we are not here to be intimidated. We are not here to bow to these intimidations. When I look at this letter, it is not comprehensive. What is being portrayed here is not who we are. It's not who we are. ED, you will agree with me that if you author a letter, if you author a letter, while depending on a reported speech, you may end up authoring a letter that does not reflect the reality of the moment of the situation. As a chief executive of the city, you need to get information from always. But she does not sit far when we are meeting here. She gets this information. The information is not wrong. The information is right. So the letter may be reflecting uh, what things should be the guidelines or the guidance of the way we are supposed to run business with the political wing.